it No gunshots, but they get in Hey, what's up you guys? Craft Farms here, and welcome back to my summer car. About time, if I might add. Finally got back to where I was. Um, as you can see, we have $7,640. Uh, I did do a few missions with the truck, um, and I did take a load of firewood as well. And then I pumped a couple of sewage wells. Um, so we're going to start off. I do have the... Uh, muscle car here as well and in the trunk we have some food so we're gonna go ahead and get something to eat take care of that hunger and then we're gonna get the engine finished up today um, so this week has kind of been a little bit messy in terms of video schedules um, or videos and whatnot but next week will be Back to the way it was. It'll be all fine and dandy. Um, <clears throat> Alright, so first off, let's pop this open. And we need a 5. So we need to put the camshaft in. And that has just the two 5mm bolts. Okay, then we need a 10. We need the camshaft gear. So today we're going to get the engine finished up and get it put into the car. Um, so yeah, we got a lot of stuff ahead of us. A lot of work left on this car, but we're chipping away bit by bit at it. Okay, so now we need a six millimeter. There's something on my mouse pad. Now we need the timing cover, which is that one. And that has six six millimeter bolts. Uh, the dirtiness is way high. I need to just sit down and go through like three buckets of water or something, but I wanted to get some videos out first, or at least one. Uh, I've got stuff written down in my notebook to do like three videos or four. So. Okay, then we need a seven for our next piece next few actually we need our water pump and that'll have five on it yeah I made sure that this time around I did not have permanent death on uh, that's what happened if you haven't for those of you that don't know why my summer car stopped for a little while uh, it's because I had been recording the video that I'm recording now basically um, doing all these same steps that I'm doing now but I you know then got a phone call and it was you know somebody's sewage well was full and they needed it pumped so then we took the truck well I didn't know how to put the hose in correctly and um, yeah needless to say I died well I didn't I did not even realize that um, I had permanent death on so once we died that was it and all the progress was gone so I had to redo everything which kind of really sucked but whatever um, we're back to where we were now so let's continue okay so now we need the alternator uh, this guy right here so 
So, we have one seven millimeter up here. And then the bottom one is a ten. on this side here. Okay, so now our next one that we'll need is a 7 again. So now we need the engine plate, which will go on this side. I guess it took it there. Starter. Requires two seven millimeter. Oh, I want to drop that low. Oh, there. Okay, I guess we can kind of clip through the engine then. Um, so we can keep our seven because next we need the flywheel. say I know this goes on this side so this has six and then we need to change to a six and then put the clutch discs together and get them put on which is a really easy task to put them together it's just like that oops shoot I dropped it Yeah. clutch pressure plate we just take this and then this goes right there I guess so then this has six six millimeter Okay, so now we'll need a 7 next, and our next piece is the oil pan here, um, let's see, the large end goes over here I think, yes, so this has... Eight on the bottom. So there's one, there's two, three, there's four. So that's four, that's five, okay. So we got them all here. Then we need to go get a 10 and tighten that guy. Otherwise, our oil would just come right out. Huh? That's a 10. That's what I've got. Okay, is that not what I have? Yeah, I have a 10. Oh, whoops. I'm looking at the wrong thing. I'm looking at alternator. With help. There we go. And our drive gear, which requires a 7. Oh, 7. Which is this big guy down here. Or wait, no. Drive gear. That's not it. Uh, where is the drive gear now? This guy? No, it's clutch lining. Gear linkage. Fuel strainer. Gear box. Okay, where the heck is... Oh. That's fuel pump. Where is the drive gear? 
Okay, what am I missing here? What am I missing? Oh, this thing. No, that's the distributor. There it is. Good grief. Finding the right part. Now finding where it goes. Where does it go? Okay, I gotta look. Um... Drive gear. Continue. I need drive gear. Come on, I don't want you to load every single dang thing. Just stop. Well, then. Just gearbox. <sighs> I read right over the top of gearbox. Go figure. Gearbox needs a seven. Okay, so we got that. Ugh, I just love failing on video. Okay, so it's got. Six, seven millimeter. There's one, there's two, three. Okay, that's four of them. Oh, here the other two are. Then it's got a ten millimeter, which must be what? What's the 10 for? I have no idea. We'll find out, I guess. Oh, yeah. That one right there. Wait, where'd it go? Oh. I'm losing it. Okay, so now we can put our drive gear in, and then we need our 7 back, so now for the drive gear. And that is just the one. Okay, I have a 7, do I not? Yes, I have a 7. That is what is written down, is a 7. Why do you not want to tighten it? What the heck? Maybe did I write them backwards? I don't know. Yeah, I must have written it backwards. Put... I don't know what I did. Yeah, I put six seven millimeter when it's seven six millimeter. Alrighty then. So now we do our spark plugs. So for that we need the spark plug wrench. Spark plug wrench. 
hitting them down. Okay, so now we need to get a 7 to put our fuel pump on. Which is that guy. And now I get to remember where this guy goes. Uh, I know that the way that it's in here is not quite the right way. Aha, I see where it goes. There we go. And I gotta go to the next page here. So now we just need to put our distributor in, and then this thing is ready to go into the car. So we need a six. Ah, I had it there. There we go. go tighten that down okay so now we need a 17 oh that's 11 jeez I messed up writing that second one then okay so I need to push the car forward a little more if at all possible. Okay, that should be plenty. Yep, perfect. Just make sure this is all the way up, and it is. Okay, so now we will push it into the car. Let's see, we gotta go forward a little more. Okay, now back a little bit, actually. Oh, and plus it'll kind of go forward a little bit as we drop. So let's drop this thing in. So far so good. We're going nice and straight. Actually, we need to go back a little bit more. We'll just drop it until the car starts pushing down. Until it starts pushing down on the car, and then we'll just bring it up one. Or two, I guess. Okay, so let's see if we got some bolts. If not, let's figure out what we need to do. So, nope. And basically all we gotta do is just go forward a little bit. Okay, how about now? We have bolts. Um, we do not. We gotta go back and up, it kind of looks like. Let's try down first. See what that does. Okay, so now we need to go forward a little bit. Just ever so slightly. Hopefully that wasn't too much. And of course, it was. That shouldn't have been too much there. What? Man, this is really touchy here. Aha! We have bolts. Whoa! That sure popped into place. Literally. Okay, so there's two on the front and one in the back, I think is what it had said. 
Okay, why will you not let me get that one? What the world? What's going on with you here? So here's the back one. What's your deal here? I don't know why it's not letting me... There we go. Finally. Okay, so now we'll get this thing off the hoist. And that'll be it for this video. So I'll just start the outro. Um, if you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to hit that thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel, welcome to the channel. Be sure to subscribe if you like what you see. Be sure to turn on the post notifications to be notified every time I upload a new video. Be sure to check out down below in the description for my PC specs, my upload schedule, as well as links to all of my social medias, my mod site, and some other cool YouTube channels that are definitely worth taking a look at. So, I'm just going to get uh, get the next video recorded here right away, get ahead on it, and uh, yeah, so, uh-oh. Where'd fan belt fit into that? It didn't. Well, um, I gotta take this back out. <sighs> that sucks. Okay, so, yeah, I'm gonna, I gotta take this engine back out. I forgot to put the, um, the, uh, whatchamacallit, the, uh, uh, the fan belt. I forgot to put that in, so... I gotta take this out, put the fan belt on, adjust it, and then put it back in. But, uh, yeah. So, thanks for watching. As always, we'll see you tomorrow.